the deal, YouTube? It's your boy Chill Jay. We're here with a video. Y'all already freaking on. Uh, today, I will be showing y'all the life of a door dasher. At least in Michigan. But yeah, the life of a door dasher, episode one. I'm basically gonna be showing y'all the ins and outs of being a door dasher, driving for door dash, delivering for door dash, and just the behind the scenes and everything that goes on. Why does it take so long for us to deliver y'all food at times? And just every every single concern that y'all have. If you're watching this video and you plan on being a DoorDasher, you are a DoorDasher, you like DoorDash, you order from DoorDash, anything of that nature, click this subscribe button. Because I'm going to show y'all everything and the ins and outs of this shit. And click that like button. Smash that like button. Go crazy on it. Y'all know the motto, man. Like, comment, subscribe. And take y'all on to the journey. Let's go. All right, look. So this is my routine of how I do my DoorDash. Know what I'm saying? I've been doing it since I started driving, which was 2019. Yeah. DoorDash, you know, people look at DoorDash as just, you know, some little gas money. But you can really make a lot of money off of it, for real, if you put the time into it. My dash starts at 430. So, yeah, we finna head over there to the location, to the destination, whatever you want to call it. First thing first, what you need to be a DoorDasher. You need license. You need registration. You need, well, I don't even think they care about the registration part. Kind of do. Anyway, I think they asked for my insurance. I don't remember. But insurance, you need one of these. Well, but when you get that, they give you this card where they take you to certain restaurants and they want you to pay. You don't pay out your pocket. You know what I'm saying? DoorDash take care of all that. And that's why they give you, I'm going to show y'all in one second, this card. Yeah, they give you they give you a car like that. They all look the same, so that's that, right? The difference between me and everybody else that do DoorDash, I'm gonna tell y'all straight up. I'm gonna tell y'all the pros and the cons of the shit. It's your boy Chill Jack. We here with that video, y'all. Right, now we're here at the destination. Uh, I'm gonna show y'all how my screen look once you um, actually start the DoorDash or your dash. Basically, guys, so you click Dash now once you're in the area. These are the four things that they ask you. Is your phone charged? Uh, it's on the charger, but my shit acting up. Anyway, is your phone charged? Do you have enough gas? Do you have that red card that I showed y'all? Then you got the hot bag and space blank. Basically that bag. So we just gonna, you know, hit all four. That's what most people do anyway, just to get it started. These are the hot spots. These are the hot spots, you know what I'm saying? Like right now, uh, well, this one like right up the street for me, but this is normally the hot spot. Like where I'm at, that's normally a hot spot. But maybe when it hit like later on during the day, um, that pop up. You got another one right up the street going towards that way somewhere, and then you got the, and then you got the other ones. A order will pop up at some point, but yeah. If you plan on being a DoorDash. And you trying to make a good amount of money, like I'm talking like at least a hundred dollars a day or something like that, anywhere close to that. Do not go to the hood. I repeat, do not go to the hood. Do your best to avoid places that's near the hood. Don't even go near the hood. Any any cities that's near the hood, if you live in the city of Detroit. And you go somewhere like Redford or, I don't know, Inkster, Garden City. You know, places like that that's close to Detroit. Don't go there. Because all they're going to do is send you back to the city. You got to go to the burbs. I'm sorry to say. I know how my black community is. I love my black community. I'm black myself. But we just don't tip. Black people don't tip. Not to say that white people don't tip. Because I I done ran into some rich motherfuckers out here and they didn't give me a dime, my nigga. But yeah. Uh more of the story. The hood don't tip. Let's put it that way. And if you wanna make some money, long story short, if you wanna make some real money, go out to the suburbs and stay out there. Make your money, come back to the hood, and then be all right. I don't know why, but I did not get an order yet. It's kind of weird. 
Cause there's hot spots everywhere around me. You telling me I ain't getting no order yet? Come on, I, I don't know. I don't know how long it's gonna take from you know for an order to pop up. But when one do pop up, um, I'll show y'all that part, and then we can get straight to the first day. Rags rich, rags rich, rags rich, rags rich. Okay, guys, we finally got our first order. Uh, this is a normal order, six dollar order. Yeah, y'all didn't really hear me say it, but basically, you go in there and you just tell them, "Hey, I'm picking up a door that has order for such and such name." Well, they might ask, what's the name on the order? And you tell them the name, and then you go on about your day. Now that we got the food, you know what I'm saying? We want to make sure we put the food in the bag. You just put that in there, you know? Uh, a lot of people zip it up so it can stay warm, but my zipper broke. But I ain't, it ain't like I'm touching it. Take this bullshit-ass mask off. Then once you do that, um... So you see this screen, you just gonna click confirm, confirm pickup, it's gonna ask you please confirm the following. Then you just gonna click it, cause you already got the full, come on now. And then it give you the notification of how to get there. So, damn, see? This is what I was talking about when I said, don't go anywhere or try to avoid cities that's near the hood. See, I live in Detroit. Livonia is like literally right next to Detroit. That's where they about to take me. When I'm done with this order, I'm getting the fuck on. It's bad. Alright guys, we're here. I'm not gonna show the address or none of that. But basically. You pull up to the shit, right? You know what I'm saying? Boom. So, since COVID is going on, normally we will wait for them to open the door, but since COVID going on, we just leave it at the door. So, complete delivery. Oh, see, it don't give me no other directions. So, confirm, and it's that easy. Now I got $6 in my pocket right there. That's how you do it right there. And basically the money just keep building from there. All right, let me talk to y'all about like the money range that you can make, how much money you can make in DoorDash. I ain't gonna lie, that bitch go from $3 and up, like $3 and up. But me personally, I don't accept anything under $5. Five, anything $5 and up, I'll accept. Like five, I say five to $8 is normal. Five to seven, five to $8, that's a normal order. Anything $9 and up, $10 and up, nigga, oh yeah, you in your bag, you feel me? Because you got to think, shit, $10, $10, $10 on each run, that shit add up. My nigga, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, and go on so on. So, the goal is to try to get orders like that. That's why we come out here to the suburbs. But when they start giving that big money, I'm gonna show y'all. Y'all gonna see the y'all gonna see what I'm talking about. See, I just got an order for to go to Tropical Smoothie. I don't know if y'all can see that. Seven dollars. You know what I'm saying? That's a normal run, but I should have never I should never well I stopped to make this clip for y'all, but I should never did that um in a way. Luckily I'm in an area. Luckily, the people house is in the area, so I'm not worried about going to the hood. But after this order I'm doing, well, that I'm about to do, I'm pausing it, and we're going back to the suburbs. All right, I just went and picked up the Taco Smoothie order. Now, obviously, I'm not going to show y'all every single order I pick up, but... Damn, she thick as hell. Let me give it to you one more time. Woo! I'm going to catch up with y'all. Hey, I'm sorry, but baby girl, I was looking at was kind of wreck. Shit, I should have went back in her head with the hey, how you doing? Can I get a bomb, my mama with you on the side? 
Damn, damn, I just got a $14 order. You see what I mean? Now, when I say you get an order that's $10 and up, you in your bag. But this is a double order. It's not like it's all in one order. But they're still good. Okay. I'm a fog with it. These niggas order hella stuff. Like, dang. But it's worth the money and it's worth the wait. Y'all already freaking out. Uh, where we going? Oh, shit. We out here where the matches at, y'all. Hold on, man. This where the big money be at, man. Y'all better get hit, man. If y'all got a car and y'all trying to make some money, this is the way. So that bitch right there. You know what I'm saying? Confirm. I ring the doorbell. Ooh, no, we ain't gonna do all that. We just gonna dip. Well, man. Tag me the funny ones too. Damn, why is there so many people inside of Ma's Pizza? Yellow busy Restaurant occupied right here on Hot One. Shit. Yeah. Why is so many people in there? Man, forget all that. So, if y'all ever run into an order and y'all don't want to do the order or y'all want to cancel it, so, like right now, like right now, I'm on a double order. So, I ain't gonna lie. Shoot, for $20, though? Nah, I can make $20 quicker than this. But basically, you hit the little icon. I'm doing a double order, so it's gonna pop up like this. Click the name, say you can't. You or other you click the person, it's gonna ask you unsign. You accept the two orders for $19. Your new minimum pay will be $9.50, and your completion rate will go down to $94. We don't give a fuck about that. And then you basically just tell them why. You really don't have to, you could just put something else. But I'm gonna say, then you just do the same thing to this one. Now, y'all see this, right? That's 1065. That's almost half of what I would have made if it wasn't that many people here. Shit, I was not about to wait at that freaking Mars Pizza. No. When I say it was hella people, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. Uh, I burned a camera in there, but I honestly don't think I was recording. So if y'all didn't see that part when I walked in and showed the people, then I didn't get it. But I wasn't about to sit there. That's dead. So we ain't going BJ's restaurant. It's a nice little restaurant, you know what I'm saying? They are trying to open up the schools, but not the movies. And more people gonna be around each other at school. Fuck out of here. And we are here. <clears throat> I guess this. I guess this white dude or this white guy thought that I was gonna. Like, go to the side door, because the light on, but I don't know, shit. I just went to the front door, you feel me? I'm so used to dropping off the food at the front door. Came outside from the side door like I did something wrong. I'm like, I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. I, I thought you would, I ain't think you was going to come from the side door, you feel me? I'm thinking, I'm thinking, you know, that's just what they lights do. But I didn't, you wouldn't think that they going to pop at the side door, you feel me? Or at least not everybody. Some people do, but not everybody. Just I just go with the generic, you know what I mean? It looked like he was kind of mad, but I told him, like, look, I ain't know. Do -do -do. I sat in on the front porch, but here you go. We will have a nice day. He was looking on some bullshit the way he was looking at me. Like, I did something wrong. Like, put it in the instructions next time, motherfucker. Damn! What the fuck? Hold on. Let that shit blur up. That nigga tipped me more money. I fucked around. That order turned into a $20 order. That's crazy. That's more money. Bro, that's the same amount of money. A dollar more than what I would have made at Mod's Pizza. That's crazy. Now look where I'm at. And then this order just popped up. I'm sorry. Thank you. But no, that shit, that shit low-key made me a little mad. But thank you. All right, guys. We at Smoothie King right now. I had here once. I never. I would never drink. I would never get no drink here again. Hey, how you doing? Uh, no, I have a DoorDash order. I have one for Diana. Cool, cool. Oh, okay. You too.
It looked like old girl low key wanted to say something. She was smiling at me and shit. Y'all couldn't see it, but y'all didn't see it, but I seen it. Ah, oh, hell no. Nah. They sending me to Detroit. Ah, oh, hell no. Nah. Oh my God, bro. See, I knew it, bro. I knew these niggas was going to send me to the D. This really just pissed me off. Like, this shit make me not even want to. This shit make me want to go home. I ain't even going to lie, because they basically taking me to the crib now. Like, no, bro. That's not what I was trying to do, bro. Oh, my God, man. And then they taking me wet. Like, they taking me deep into the city to act that. It's not like they taking me like, at the edge of Detroit where it's like, where you got like Redford and then you got the next city. It's not like that. They taking me deep into the city. This is like the fourth, fifth time I done went to Livonia today. I'm convinced that they just taking me to Livonia for today. I don't know what it is, y'all, but hey, if that's where the money at, we all give a fuck! We currently made $75 so far. I would have made a lot more money quicker if they weren't sending me to the hood doing them far runs. I would have made at least like $120 or something like that. And it's not much. A lot of people probably gonna look at it like, nigga, that ain't shit. But, you know. Onto North Drive. It ain't Christmas no more, nigga. Take the shit down. Still lit though. Damn. Walgreens? $13? Okay. Boy had to get him a caramel fried pay, man. This bitch is bang. I don't really I don't really eat they food. I don't eat they food at all. But I get they caramel fried pay. Yes, yeah, sir. This order is too good to be true. How many items they got? What you know about love on your Friday they only got four items on my face. Let me find out. Oh my god, they're going X Games mode. Oh. Alright, let's go in this bitch. What are you looking for? Oh, I'm getting some light service. I'm doing a door ass order. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah. I was wondering how do I select it and stuff like that. Uh, you just put add item. Since I got it in the bag, and then you go to the next one. You know what I'm saying? Chill. You know where y'all Starburst is at? Down this aisle. Right here? I'm not going through the whole store like I did last time. That's dead as fuck. All right. Starbucks. Where the fuck they Starbucks is at? Shit. Early free with this shit, man. No cap. Alright, we're here in the band aid section. Now, where the fuck we? Let's get this last item so we can go. Uh, found it closest to it. It's basically the same thing for real. Thank you. You too. That's how you do a DoorDash order when you going to like a Walgreens or somewhere like that. A pharmacy, basically. If y'all enjoying this video right now, smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. If y'all like videos like this, let me know. If y'all want me to keep dropping episodes like this, just let me know so I can um, keep dropping them for y'all, you know. Hold on, I just thought about You're something. I got tips in person throughout sure the week, too. Perfectly good excuse. So, technically, <laughs> I get it. technically, I made over a hundred. So, what better time than now? Let's begin. Raise one finger if you're a man. Ladies, none yet. I'm going to the crib, right? Damn, I wonder what happened. Damn. Rags to riches. Rags to riches. Rags to riches. Rags to riches.
But yo, I'm back at the crib. We already freaking up. Y'all enjoyed this video in any type of way? Smash that like button. Go crazy on it. If you're new to the channel, click that subscribe button. If you if you learn anything new, or this video encourage you to want to DoorDash, or you know, click that subscribe button, man. Join the gang. Get with your boy. Let me know if y'all want another episode of a, a Life of a DoorDasher. You know what I'm saying? I'll keep dropping these, man. Got y'all. Just let me know, though. Don't just watch it and not say anything. So, it's your boy Children. I'll catch y'all in the next video.